Hi, I'm Elaine. I'm looking for a tall, solvent man who's very kind and considerate. I work as a legal secretary, and my interests include going to the theatre, eating good food, and playing tennis. Give me a call. Hello, I'm Margaret, I'm 46, and I've never come. Um, I think I maybe did come a couple of years ago, but my friends say that if I'm not sure, I probably didn't. Uh, I was just wondering, um, is this it? <laughs> or I I is this it? Ow, 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 ow. Or, or is this it? Or is this it? <laughs> That's not, not, not too sure. Hi, I'm looking for a guy. Um, I'm looking for quite a sensitive guy. Uh, someone who's going to be sensitive, sensual, sexy. <laughs> someone who's going to someone who's going to make me feel sexy. Someone who's going to kiss me in a in a particular way. I, someone who's going to kiss me in a um, sorry, can I, would you mind just, um, can I borrow you for a minute? I just want to demonstrate, I've got this thing, it's, it's really nice, it really works for me. Would, would you mind? That's great, thanks a lot. Um, I want to be, I want to be, just, sorry, just, just sit, just sit there, that's fine. Um, I want to be kissed in, uh, in a particular way, um, maybe this will help you to understand, maybe something like this. Andy? Maybe, maybe a bit longer, actually. <laughs> mm. Um, feel free to Andy? use tongues if you want to. Andy, can I? No, 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 it's fine. No, he's enjoying it, it's fine. Um, one more time. Hello. I'm looking for a man who also regrets his punk past. Obviously, I had a great time, lots of fun and laughs, but I do also have that. <laughs> because otherwise I think I look quite like Dame Diana Nick. It's disgusting, isn't it? I haven't washed my hair for about three weeks. Hi, I'm really shallow and boring. Um, I haven't got much to say. I can't be asked to get a job. I'm obsessed with my own problems. Not really bothered by physical hygiene. Um, yeah, basically I'd be a financial and emotional drain on anyone stupid enough to go out with me. But I do swallow. <laughs> it's your decision. My name's Patricia and I live in Wentworth. I like boating and golf and hunting. I attend Ascot regularly and enjoy polo. Can we go back to the boating picks of all time? <laughs> Just do it one more time. <laughs> From the beginning. <laughs> My name's Patricia and I live in Wentworth. I like boating and golf. For fuck's sake, stick to the script. Oh, fuck it. If I could choose any man in the world, it would have to be a bomb. Now, I don't mind which one, as long as he's got night vision goggles and an exploding pen, because, well, that'd be very exciting. I'm looking for a man who... I'm looking for a man who suffers from premature ejaculation. <laughs> I'm a beautiful lady with long golden hair and huge breasts. When you date me, I'm going to hug your breath away. I can go all night if you want me to. Come, come aboard the love train. <laughs> I'm 
29 years old. I can strip a Kalashnikov in under five minutes. I can breathe underwater for up to two hours. I can live on earthworms and spiders for up to three months. If you want to go out with me, call me. I don't have a phone. There's your challenge. Find me. <laughs> I'm hoping to meet a man called Carlos or at least somebody who doesn't mind being called Carlos. I don't particularly like the name Carlos, but I have a tattoo on my bottom. It says, I love Carlos, and I can't afford to have it removed. Is it okay to keep the cushion? Because I'm, I'm a little bit nervous. You're great. <laughs> Hello, I'm Harry. I live in Padstow. I've got a fine fisherman's cottage on the beach. Um, it's full of, you know, tiles and bits of old boats. Um, I like rambling and long, wet country walks and um, poshing about in antique shops and going to Rex Stein's restaurant and Shut up! <sighs> Wish I wasn't so posh. <laughs> Hi, I'm Annie and I live in Upper Largo and I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, what's so special about her? So what? Well, you know how people always say you end up looking like your mum? Well, I brought my mum along. <laughs> I'm a surprise waiting to happen. <laughs> I'm recently separated. We weren't really compatible. I was an Aquarius and he was a complete <laughs> to say anything. <laughs> you can just look and that's it. <laughs> and if that isn't enough, then you clearly don't appreciate the finer things in life. <laughs> I've got a castle. <laughs> oh. I want a man um, who's really really good looking, but who, like, doesn't know it at all. Um, who has, like, a really hilarious sense of humour, but who can be, like, really, really serious when I say. Um, he should have, like, a high-powered job, maybe in the city, but he shouldn't be motivated by money at all. And... He should be, like, really spontaneous um, when it comes to presents, but it should mainly be stuff that I, like, wanted already. <laughs> and he should be really, really tough, but really, really gentle. And he should have quite a large penis, <laughs> but he shouldn't feel that he has to use all of it <laughs> all of the time. And he's got to be able to fly. 